just another quick one. Um, this is my custom Xbox. I've got other videos of it on my channel. One um, little add-on I have done to it is I've put a toggle switch. I only got this one. This was just a cheap one from Halfords. And what I've done is I've wired it up to one of the uh, sources of the fan, one of the leads. And what I've done is I can split this toggle switch between 5 and 12 volt. Just like, just like that, really. I'm going to show you really quick. Okay, so that's the standard speed. Okay. Quiet. Now the reason why I put the toggle switch on is because I do a lot of online gaming, I do a lot of Call of Duty, a lot of Forza, and I do tend to find it gets a bit hot. And after my old ones that come with the ROD, I've learnt my lesson, and um, I tend to keep them cool. Yeah, there you go. Okay, when I find that it gets a bit, gets a bit hot, I tend to switch it. So if you listen, you can hear it. Sounds like a rocket. Yeah. That's 12. You can have it on all the time, whatever. And then just go. It takes it back down. That's where it was. Back on again. I'm going to hopefully drill the uh, the case soon and have the actual switch hanging out of it instead of just having it hanging out the side of the air vents. So I, le I learned my lesson, I put a bigger fan in, it's a few mil bigger. Makes all the difference because remember it's round. Especially now I've got it split between 5 and 12. So if it's late night gaming and you want to make that noise, you want to watch a film, this is brilliant. If you're, you're playing a lot of Call of Duty, especially on zombies, oh, make for the Black Ops 2, that's going to be wicked. And you just go, just crack that. It's all fine. Wicked. I'm going to try and upload another video to show you how you actually wire one of those switch. But if you want to know where that switch from, I actually got it from Halfords for 179 Seems to work alright. 